welcome back, Bessie and the crew. So, today I'm going to try the basketball thing, but it's not going to be the full, how can you say, the full picture. I cannot get the measurements right, y'all, and that is a freaking headache. So, I'm hearing everybody saying this is the material that they are using, which is a HTV uh, printable iron-on. Uh, it comes with five sheets. I've been had some, but you know. I'm also try a water slide method. Even though this is the transparent one, I just want to see if we stick to the basketball. If so, that means, you know, that's another method that people can use. So I'm going to get started with that. So I already, like I said, I'm just going to do a little small image. I didn't do the whole thing. The measurements are crazy. I, I don't know the, you know how and i'm trying to still figure out like how to get in the whole piece of paper because the whole piece of paper still don't fit all the way around if that makes any sense too unless they doing it see that like the whole piece of paper don't even fit these things so i don't know what they're doing maybe they ordering by the roll or something but for some reason people are acting stingy and they don't want to tell what they're doing they'll tell you but they won't show you and i can understand the hustle you don't get it twisted but I mean, like, dang, give us, get, at least do a video or a preview or something. I mean, like, God. Anywho, we'll figure it out. Ain't that right, best you crew? But I will continue to work on the measurements. Uh, I don't even know if this going to work, y'all. Y'all know how I am. I just be getting on here. So we're just going to wing it. Yeah, see. Okay, I know you're supposed to pull the backing off, you know, with any dark transfer. The difference between the light and the dark is um, the light has to be flipped horizontal. And then it don't have a backing to peel off. Took me a while to learn that too. So, you just pull the backing off. I had a heat transfer tape that came off my size of brand. I was going to try to use that to hold it down clear so i have this <laughs> i don't know if it's gonna work y'all like just, hey. uh i just want to know and i do got my heat press already heating up i don't know what the heat settings are so don't come for me i just want to show y'all if we can do it or not since nobody else want to come show y'all, so just say thank you. Don't be fussing about what I did not do. I don't see this working out fine either because of... What else should I cut? We're just going to wing it. We're going to wing it. We're going to wing it. So we're going to go over here to the heat press. Okay, so we're just going to wing it. We're just gonna put it under there. Hopefully, I'm up on pop. It's four nine nine. So we're just gonna wing it. I feel like I don't know how they get it to not ball up if it's a curved image. And that's good enough for me because I don't want to pop the ball. Okay. So, it did stay. So, that's a good thing. So, to the ones that's uh, doing the whole picture, I feel like you can just, you know, like do just a picture. You know what I mean? Like, you ain't got to have a background. You can put a couple logos or something on there. 
So that technique did work pretty good. I feel like use an iron or something that where you can see and you can actually lay the paper down real good on it. That's just my opinion. Okay, so now I'm gonna try the water the water slide. And it is the clear one, like I said. So don't come for me. Okay. Oh, my scissors. Shoot. Okay. I'm just going to sit there in some water. And I really didn't waste a lot of my cell. I sprayed it two times. You're supposed to spread three. To, um, how do you say it? To make sure it's going to seal and all that good stuff. Show some kind of support. I know you're watching it, but show me some kind of support. Just letting it soak. Okay, so I'm going to, oh Lord, I'm tripping, tripping. I'm going to put it over by my great hat. Okay, let's see. I think he's supposed to put a little water or something on it. Like I said, we're just learning together. So this is transparent, so of course you know you ain't going to really be able to see it, see it. I just want to see, will it work on there and will it stay? Just another method for folks that's just, you know, water slide users. And they do got a white water slide. And I, I feel like it'll look better with a water slide if you did the color one. I just want to see what it take to the basketball, though. feel like it will. It is round, so you gotta remember that. So I will use an image that I know I, I know how to maneuver. It's almost like I, if you're using it on a cup, you had to, you know, cut certain stuff. But I left it whole, so it is kind of putting lines in it. So I'm just moving it around, trying to see where to put it at. Feel like it will wrinkle up a lot if you don't um, cut it to the shape of or something. Maybe I don't know. Yeah. So maybe the water slide technique would not work. Yeah, it's wrinkling. Or maybe it will work. 
Just gotta work the wrinkles and stuff out because it looks like it's starting to work kind of right now. All right, so I just I wonder how do they, you know, when they do the uh, water slide. I ain't good at with the water slide either. Y even though I did that one little cup. I just, I feel like, I hear people say you just want to put it in the oven. I'm not in the oven. I sealed it, so I didn't know about no oven. Okay, y'all, now it's starting to do right. So I guess I just got to keep playing with it. Oh, shit, I'm about to knock y'all down. Let's just keep playing with it. Just kind of mashing it onto the ball. Pretty cool. I like it. I like this better. So I feel like a water slide would be better than an um HTV. Look at that. It's actually laying down now. It's like no more wrinkles. It's actually going into the ball. Like you do little holes and everything. So that's awesome. So I guess just keep playing with it. I don't know how it's gonna look when it's gonna dry, but you know. Okay, and so with that, I think you can just seal it. That is cool. You got to see it in person. But it actually looks great. Let's see if I can do a better lighting. So when it's dry, this should be perfect. Okay, so we got that side and we got this side. Which is, it's still gonna look bad. First time, so, you know, I feel like if I would have made the image smaller, and I feel like you can probably use a spray sealer to give it like a shiny coat on it. Hmm. Other than that, I like it. Come, I'll come up with some better stuff, but I could not figure out that um, technique. I really couldn't. I really couldn't figure it out, like, with the the measurements and everything. It was just a freaking headache. To me, you can do a water slide, like, get your image into almost like the shape. And, hell, cut what you don't need. They making it complicated. For people, and I'm up here wrecking my brain trying to figure it out. And I'm like, you know what? It got to be a better way. So, something simple and easy. That's for me. I like it easy. Y'all have a blessed one.